Hey guys, me Toast Burger, and I'm gonna review Body Shot Infinite. Spe specifically, um, the, D the DLC and this game. Let's get started. Um, what's the game about? Winner of over 80 awards. Bring it to go, white boy to death. The year 1912. Demon dead, Booker to it. I had only one opportunity for a clean sweat. Rescue Elizabeth. Um, a mysterious girl in prison, in prince and tired, in the flying city of Columbia, forced to trust one another. They must harness an expanding arsenal of weapons and abilities as they fight to survive the flood of the city and cover the dark secrets. That's a big plot. There's more to it that meets the eye, but since it's getting old, you know what's in it. And I'm playing this game, who the I played this game way back in, in 20, um, 20, 2015. When this game came out, and I'd say this game still holds up, up to this day. Here's the thing: Troy Baker at the end, Booker the way at the end. Um, I don't know, I don't know who played it with They, they are the two like best characters in this entire game. But anyway, Bioshock One and Bioshock Two, which had some protagonists and didn't have no personality, Booker the way and literally had personality, and I love them. Like they're both great characters. Like, and this game at the is very, very, very dark and awesome. Basically, if you seen the if you seen the multiverse theory or read comics or played or played um I don't know how to get that multiverse theory or seen your TV show at Fringe, you know what I mean. Um, the and this game also had a lot of I can see this uh certain undertones. Like racism and all that bullshit that I'm in the 1912. Then oh boy, when you get to the <laughs> it it's really, really fucked up. Um, graphically, graphically this game is not age well. I don't care about graphics. I care about more character and story. And this game still holds up. Now, this game, now does it, does this mean graphics are still amazing? On the PC, yes. On the on the console, and I could do 16 on my video. It's still a good game. Uh, acting the game by Troy Baker and I don't know if I read my acting, I forgot to look it up. Um, but she's great, the characters are great, the story is great. Everything about this game is good. Oh, what type of game book for that? Okay, Game Boy 1, if you played Bioshock 1 or played Bioshock 2, you know I had to play Bioshock game already. Like, Game Boy has not changed. The only thing that they added is the whole Skyhook scene. And Skyhook Sky stuff? That's actually really cool. I do love the Skyhook, um, like, um, mechanic. It, it, it doesn't really work. Um, the, the one downside I have in this game is the, the, the like, gun swap. Like, you can't, you can't carry a lot of guns. You're going, carrying, like, two guns at a time, which is kind of stupid. I don't like that idea. I'm more, I'm more a fan of having, like, more guns than Bioshock 1, but I can understand where they're going with that. They want you to be limited. Which makes sense. Um, speaking of the of, of gun power, let's talk about the plasma with like or Vegas. Um, if you if you play by the one after you, you know after that you get power like a plasma. While the Vegas they're cool, they're not really the same like the plasma are. Speaking of the uh, speaking of that, yeah, mind you, speaking of. Um, AI companion. What's her about Elizabeth? Um, Elizabeth AI. It's so great that like she's not she's not gender in distress. Nope. She gives you weapons. She gives you like E. Like the end part that she she helps you and then like the um like basically open tears, which is actually pretty cool. Um, acting great, story line great, the gameplay is good. It's not perfect, but you know it's still it's, the gameplay is still good. Um. Speaking of the, uh, of the, of, uh, speaking of the way, I don't mind, uh, let's talk about the villains for a sec. Comstock, and, um, Songbird, and, look, well, Daisy. Okay. Songbird, unlike the big daddy, who, uh, you know, protect the little sisters, which, spoil it, about that, you get, laughter is someone involved in this. Well, can you spoil it, um, um, like, Songbird is a very interesting character. He, he, then, and he's actually a very, very uh, tragic character. And I actually look somber. Is he called the Big Daddy? Well, 
you know, we made the big guys are cool. But some are still awesome and badass. Um, I think that's better than getting too much spoiled since again, don't, since again, don't worry if the, um, yeah, that's what I did, though. I'm gonna have this up. Okay, um, I'm gonna probably have this up. Sink, Sink Bowser, everything else is getting a remaster. That's the, um, Dark Man picking this up. Um, if you're curious, I say pick it up, but be warned. If you're not playing Bioshock 1, or, you can even skip 2, or not playing Bioshock 2, you will not get the references of this game. Because this game heavily references Bioshock 1, and it's awesome. Oh, by the way, one more thing, the two DLCs, the Bioshock 2 DLCs, I'll probably do a review on those, or so see for those. Because the DLC, oh boy, that DLC is very interesting and very fucked up. I highly recommend it. Um, I think that probably never get into a spoilers. Final part. Um, final part. I get by that imminent. Hey, don't please. Hey, final part. Actually, no, wait, it pulled up final part stars. Final part, final part stars. Well, it's a kind of game, but not, it's not that great. But you know what? It's still a good game. I highly recommend it. Also, the E2 chair that they did lie to us. So, yeah. So, if you want to know about this game, actually, it's watch on YouTube. Anyway, um, that's my view of Bioshock Eminem, actually, um, that I've been winning for years, so I just use it, right? Um, please don't comment down below until you think about this game. Do I get to do it? Also, um, what's your favorite, favorite, um, private man? What's your favorite Bioshock game? Me, personally, it's, um, Bioshock 1 and Bioshock Eminem. I don't know what, I'm going to go with, I'm going to go with Bioshock Eminem and Bioshock 1. Both getting a tie, because they're both great. Bioshock 2 is, uh, not that great. Oh boy, that game. Just play Infinite and Bioshock, Bioshock 1. You, you'll thank me later. And for 2K, I, 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 I can't believe you're gone. Why 2K? Why? That's not happening already. I mean, um, that's my video about your Infinite. Um, please don't comment on anything you think about this game. Do I get to it? Also, on a video page, on Twitter, and please don't comment on Oh, yeah, one more thing. Say two more review of the Burial at Sea DLC. Because, oh boy, those games are actually all hyper in with the Bioshock 1. So stay tuned with that. Okay, anyway, I'm Tyler Spoken, and that's my video about the Eminent. And, um, take care. Oh yeah, one more thing. Bring out the girl, and wipe boy to death. <laughs> See ya. Bye.